Hello, today we are going to learn about an ellipse, its definition, characteristics and elements such as the circular directrix, tangent line, concentric external circle, etc. We are going to explain the different properties of these elements and we are going to learn how to use a template which will be very useful to work out the main axis of the ellipse and the corresponding elements of any ellipse. So the definition of an ellipse. An ellipse is a curve in a plane surrounding two focal points such that the sum of the distances to the two focal points is constant for every point on the curve. This constant is also equal to the length of the longest axis of our ellipse, in this case AB, as can be seen here on the screen, and we commonly call this length 2A. If 2A is equal to the longest axis AB, that means A is going to be half of this axis, as can be seen here highlighted in red, this is going to be the distance from the focal points to point C or D on the ellipse. So to continue, if we elongate the line F prime P and set the compass on P with a radius PF, we are going to scribe an arc to the left to transport this distance onto the elongation of F prime P, obtaining a new point F double prime. The distance between F prime and f double prime is equal to 2a. This is the radius of the circular directrix whose center is located on the point f prime. We call it cf highlighted here in red. We are going to use this circle in most of the ellipse exercises, especially ones related with tangent lines. So to finish this template we join point F with point F double prime and we obtain a line segment whose perpendicular bisector T is tangent to the ellipse at point P, as can be seen here in red. And to finish this explanation, we are going to talk about another special circle connected with the ellipse. This circle is called a concentric external circle, which has its center at point O and with the radius OA or OB, as can be seen here in red. One of the most important characteristics of this circle is that it always passes through the perpendicular intersections between the tangent lines and its corresponding line segments F, F double prime, as can be seen here. All these elements of an ellipse form an important template which can be used as a tool to help in many uh, ellipse exercises, especially ones with tangent lines. So I hope this video has helped you. Please press like or subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you would like to, you can always support us by pressing the super thanks button. So until the next video, thank you very much.